So for this video, I'm going to be talking about um, developing a new fighting style, a play style, whatever you guys want to call it. <clears throat> um, in this video, I am playing in third person on PC, um, as like you'll see in the gameplay. But uh, the reason why I thought about this video is because like there's tri there's like moves, tricks, like just um, different type of fighting scenarios that most people can't do. Um, either because they don't have a PC or they don't know how to play on keyboard and mouse right and like you know they're still learning they still like trying to learn um, and all that type of stuff and so um, I'm here to talk re really I'm, I'm here to talk about is my play style in the video because I was doing like some crazy ass play style in this video um, I was doing some shit that like Probably no, but like probably nobody won't be able to pull off in the Halo community, and I feel like <clears throat> not trying to be cocky or anything, but I feel like I have the best play style on MCC um, in general. As in, as speaking in like as if like if crossplay would have came out right now, like as of today, you know, like I would have the best play style because. Nobody won't be able to do the moves that I'm doing since I'm on keyboard and mouse and everybody else is on controller. So like really the only like really the only person that could probably pull like pull off these um these play styles is probably like um immortality. I think I said uh Vic, please guys know him. Ice on devil foot. Because me and him me and him basically like really play the same way on this game. Um we both have really the same knowledge but there's some moves that I can do that he can't, but he can't do it too as well. But he's still, you know, he's still trying to process it. So um, I don't want to. I really don't want to teach anybody this move at all because this move is like kind of OP. So um, you'll see the. You'll see me do it a lot in the video. You'll see me like turning, like run, like while like running backwards in a way. So when, whenever I do that, it's like nobody can't kill me uh, unless I fuck up on the move. Because there's times when I do fuck up, such as like. Um, like I start losing momentum when I do it, I guess. So uh, I can only do it like whenever I have a groove for it. So, but at most, there's like like look at that that move right there. I can do that all the time, um, and it's like I can make turns, twists. I can make all types of directional, um, no turns, or whatever. And like, if you're playing a controller. Or if you're like playing the first person on you know, keyboard and mouse, you know, or I mean, you know, either way, you know what I'm saying? You just like won't be able to like maybe keep track of me because the way I'm playing, unless you like, you know, uh, unless you know how to play like I do type shit. Because, you know, I have, because I still have an experience a person doing this to me and shit like that. But um, that should have been the kill, but you know, actually, see, there you go. But <clears throat> shoulder glitching on here, I can set that up perfectly fine. I can run away and like. You know, not be able to die just fine, time to time I can, but I'm still trying to master it. Uh, I'm jumping over people's head. I can do that like in a hot second. You'll see in the video actually. Uh, I jump over his head like so fast, but uh, what else can I do? I can like, okay, let's say like if me and you running side by side, I can like just like just casually like, kept, okay, but I can keep turning my camera like side to side, like left and right, left and right, left and right. And it will kind of like like make me swift sizes, whatever I guess if that makes sense. Like you'll see me like like turn kind of like swift side to side and stuff like that. And I can like look at you the whole entire time, like while I'm running backwards type of thing. So it's like I can basically I can like like see whatever you're doing behind me or around me. That's basically what it is. And I think like you know if you guys you know manage to come in uh, or manage to get a PC and you come to the PC assassination tower community. I think it will be best for you to play in third person and like learn how to play keyboard and mouse because you can't because you can't because even with controller you can't pull off this like the same stunts as we do um, in third person. If you're playing a third person controller, the camera um, turns with the character. If that makes sense, because like on keyboard and mouse, my camera does not turn with my character. And if that was the case, then I'll probably be a lot faster. Maybe I'm not sure, but. <clears throat> um, so like if you plan on getting a PC and you know you want to play in third person and I'll consider you playing I mean you, you can do whatever you want but if you want to be the best of the best and you know I decide you play keyboard and mouse uh it will take time for you to catch up 
Um, some of you guys can probably develop fast. But let's be honest, like, nobody, like, to be honest, I feel like not all of you guys are slow learners, but from what I've experienced from playing Assassination and stuff like that, like, it did take most of the community to, like, like catch on to how I play and to, like, you know, how me and Grief play and stuff like that. It, it took... It took everyone like a like a good amount of time to like catch on like how we play and catch on how we fight and how we play. You know what I'm saying? It's just it, it just it's just like that. And for keyboard and mouse, it's a lot it's it's a lot harder. I feel like especially if you don't play keyboard and mouse in general or if you haven't before, so it's gonna be a lot harder. And um, you know, <clears throat> um, on controller controller like I still haven't I only fought like maybe like one controller player to be honest. That was the move right there I did. Like that was that move right there was fucking crazy. Um like I was like running like side to side and like while like running backwards in a way and he hit my back and you know, like I guess that it didn't register, I guess. Yeah, so I just like, you know, kinda killed him like that. But uh like I was saying, you know, if you're playing a controller, you know, not saying that you won't like be at a disadvantage, but like I feel like majority of the time if you're fighting against me or like Vic or whatever then you'll be at a disadvantage because you know what we're doing and um me and Vic you know we've experienced you know a lot more keyboard and mouse play than most people in the community um so yeah um I'm not gonna make any type of like tips and tricks videos on like how to play in a certain way because I feel like everybody gonna use that against me, and I want. And to be honest, I don't want that shit to happen, because you know, I, I you know, I want to be like, you know, basically, I want to be like that person up there still, because, um, because I feel like right now I'm rusty on controller. I'm be honest with you, like I have like, I feel like I'm limited on a controller. Like, like you know, I can do like I can do anything on controller. To be honest, I can pull off any stunt on controller. To be honest, um, but on keyboard and the mouse, it's like a whole different, like a whole different aspect. Like if I play on keyboard and mouse, I could pull off anything. And as for right now, I'm still learning new moves. I actually came up with a new move, whatever. It might kind of be like the same moves anyway, but it's like kind of like different. Um, so that was that that right there was actually one of them. That little turn I did on him, that was actually one of them. But um, but you know, I'm still developing new moves and stuff like that, and I'm still trying to like confuse people so I can hop over their head faster, quick enough, and all types of different, you know, uh, sort of glitches. Um, my side steps still need, you know, better, uh, you know, more work, whatever. Even like, even though my side steps are like, are already good, but I feel like I'm missing something to them. So I'm probably just gonna work on those as well. Uh, that's probably about it. Crossplay will be out, maybe when Halo 4 drop. I'm not sure. I could be wrong. Could be before Halo Halo 4 drop. Could come out when the custom game um, browser come out, which is maybe like the next update. Maybe this maybe this August. To be honest, everything will happen. But um, maybe like the flighting, whatever will happen, and there will probably be a flighting for crossplay as well because you know they obviously need to test out crossplay before like you know um, you know before releasing it because you know they don't want the game to to crash and blah blah blah. But yeah, that's really all I want to talk about is my play style and stuff.